Hi, I'm Lucy Liu, and I am in Lebanon in the Becca Valley. And I am right now in an incredibly underfunded refugee camp. The people have come here from Syria. They fled from the war-torn country. There are about a million displaced people right now, and about 500,000 of them are children. There's no protection for them here, and it's so vital that we come and we give them some aid, any aid that we can. So obviously this is no place for children. This is where disease spreads, scabies, fleas, and lice is what's happening right now in this camp. Also, the possible outbreak of cholera. But if you notice, there are kids absolutely everywhere. And they're desperate to go to school. They're playing in waste, in, in rubble, and basically in garbage. I'm here with Luciano, who works with UNICEF. I, I want to talk to you about the children here and the people. They need nutrition, they need immediate medical care, all of those things. I mean, it's, it's almost impossible to prioritize anything over anything else because everything is so interconnected. Water and sanitation, education, protection from abuse and exploitation, healthcare, all of those things are connected. Right now, there are maybe 150,000 Syrian children in Lebanon, not in school. We expect that by the end of the year, we'll be at uh, four to 450,000 out of school Syrian children in Lebanon, uh, which is a, an education catastrophe in itself. We're now in the process of a massive scale up uh, across all of the country to make sure that as many children as possible uh, who are in need of assistance uh, get the support that they need. This is a children's crisis and it's getting worse. Every child deserves a childhood and UNICEF can give them that. It just breaks my heart to have left these kids in these villages, you know, without anything. I'm, I'm asking you to please find out about this crisis and to donate anything that you have to these children because they really need it and I know how much they would appreciate it. They desperately want to go to school and we can help them. We can give them that very basic thing. This is not a dream but it is for them and it shouldn't be. So thank you for listening and thanks for tuning in.